All right. So today is a snowy day, but then I had to start my camping outside. Um, it's about three o'clock in the afternoon now. I'm about to go to uh, this nearby river and then there's a small uh, hi there's, there's a nearby river here actually day is just like this today so there's a nearby river down there I want to just set up my tent and camp there that was planned and then I, I thought today is the day for that so let's see how it goes Hi, hello so I thought weather is nice actually this is nice <laughs> it's not in favor but it's beautiful I like it this way so the river I'm intending to camp in is just nearby from my where I'm living I would say just 15 minutes only thing is it it is a bit remote just because I had to go across the water across the river to that little island let's see how things go I love adventure yeah this is the kind of thing I wanted to do I actually wanted to do it yesterday or no day before but then we had like two feet of snow nobody can walk I heard from the the grocery store they didn't have their big truck coming just because of that snowfall but I thought things gonna be better today didn't really but it's okay I like it look at that oh yeah yep so we'll see you so here we go I'm nearby to the place I want to be I take this street it's a bit slippery hope my shoes are good for that see what I'm carrying I have another DJI and I have this look at me I don't know if you can see my back it is a little bit too much for one man to carry but I'm doing okay so far so let's get to this that's the little river reservation nobody owns this land and this land is tonight it's mine tonight as I would say actually I'm so sweating inside my my gear oh wow yeah my shoes are promising that's the good thing so let's see how this thing go okay let me show you the place here we go oh yeah so if anybody don't know if you're first time here in this channel my name is Graham I'm, I live in Whistler Canada and I love adventure and go to places I've never been so here is the river so yeah if you are new to this channel please do subscribe and click the bell icon so you can see these videos whenever it's uploaded yeah please do that oh yeah oh wow so I know it was steep here so that's the little island not this guy this is a kind of island too but I want to just cross over to the little one and take my day there I need some firewood so let's go to the place and see how it is Oh yeah, oh yeah, here we are, to the place, and here we go. Actually, 
Somebody has tried the place. So my biggest problem will be to get the firewood. So, oh wow, look at that guys, look my stuff. So, there we are. How do I get? Yeah, let's first go to the place. Oh wow. Oh yeah. I know. That is a big hole there. If you sink in there, you will never come. But I know the water is shallow over here. So I can cross through to that little island there. Let's see how it goes. Alright. So, I'm just crossing this river. Hope it should be good for me. Here we go. Oh yeah. And about two inches there. I cross, if I follow this path, I, won't, I shouldn't be get wet. Okay. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. But I went, got wet a little bit. So meaning, Something is in right. Wow, that's beautiful. Okay. Oh yeah. That's where I am. Wow, this is beautiful. Can also cross to the other side. Okay. First step. Here. I should do it right here. That's my stuff. I need to start digging. Oh man. Oh yeah, so that was it. I think I did my tent right. That's where I'm gonna stay tonight. And first thing first, I need to get some firewood. Need to find some firewood. Without that, I can't do anything. Let me just unscrew this one here. 
and you can see around yeah it was not that difficult to set up my tent over there and look at the sun now I don't know what's the time now if it's like 5 20 5 20 is the sunset 5 23 so I'm here to grab some firewood that's the narrow tip of this island actually I'm nearby there's another the island over there that tree is on my in my favor I can just climb it in case of emergency <laughs> let's see if I can grab some firewood from this tree no I don't think this is a dead branch should be all good actually oh here here is some this guy that's a good one all right what did get break here under the snow I wonder if this is gonna get fired at all could be wasting a lot of could be wasting a lot of heat to get just to get these guys fired on but let's see you can see how deep maybe that's like one foot snow here That's the front of my tent. I have my stuff in there. Do I need to go to the other side to get some firewood? I don't know. Well, that's the big deep one right in front of me. It's so deep. There probably may be lots of fish in there. You can see water is shallowing down just to that big deep den there. I think I need to go grab some more firewood. Here we go. Oh, my shoe will not soak in water. It is already. Already. Now let's see. I think I was a little bit fussy. That's why it got soft in my ocean water. No, it happened again. Okay, I got some firewood. I think that's good enough for me. Some firewood here. Got my other camera set up there. And how I'm in, I put this little blue uh, comforter inside and well I want to be secure I want to just close this guy and be more secure here let me just yeah I know <laughs> Whew. that's it and then here's my shoes Wet shoes can stay outside. I have another outer layer. If I close this, I am in a full house. So. Oh yeah. That's not bad. At least I don't feel cold. I'm on top of the snow. <laughs> oh yeah. Wow, look at that. Plus I have another blanket here and I think 
I will also remove this. Yeah, my my ski trousers. Ah. This making me hot, wet. I think I'm secure in here. Definitely. I can spend the night here. So this is how thing happens, whether you like it or not. I brought this 10 inches mattress. So I don't know to sleep on the on the on the snow. But look, there's a cut there. It got a pump in here. So you can just pump. Yeah, you don't need an external pump for that. But then what happened? I was pumping, <laughs> pumping there. There's no air. There's no air filling that mattress. Then I realized, then I, right next to the pump, right next to the pump, there's a cut. I can hear the snow. <laughs> yeah. So, this is my stuff that I came out with. I'm gonna boil some water as well. I need some water to boil. And I got a little store here. Oh, this is my, that's a thermal. It's got my curry in it. It says it's uh, nine hours. Uh, let me see what it says. Five years limited warranty. Stay hot guaranteed. Nine hours hot, 14 hours cold. So let's see how it goes. I couldn't feel my toes actually when I crossed the river to this little island oh wow water came into my shoes so I kept my shoes outside actually yeah today is the 29th of February Here we go. Oh, so it's done. And here is my green bag. Let me just get in there. Sorry, my sleeping bag. Oh, let me just get in there. So, oh, it's getting dark outside. It's getting cold as well. I open my fire. I don't know if you can see it. I'm just making some tea over there. Do you see it? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I have some sort of fire going on there. I can't just light it inside of my tent yeah so maybe I can make some tea I was trying to get a little sleep here but it's just too cold so unlucky that I my air mattress was ripped otherwise it would have been a good uh, sleep Yeah, you can see see my breath. Oh, this uh, my. Let me see what's the temperature here. It shows five. Yeah, five Celsius. Not bad. Let's see if I can make a tea and have a good tea there. 
Ray. Well, that's not bad. Let me see my see it says nine hours of it's got a spoon here let's see how that goes Yeah. Wow. Yep. That's definitely a pro. Some potato and dal curry. Yeah, my thermal flask is not a bad one. I have a meal now, and my outside there, I would say. Well, it's burning. Don't know if I have to. Make some fire, firewood. I would do that, yeah, definitely. So fire is slowly starting there. Despite it, we have snow, it is there. So, I don't know if you see outside, it's all dark. Well, it's not bad as long as I have my fire. Too early. It's too early. 
for me to sleep but I have to stay warm I can't light any candles anything inside the tent so I had to stay warm oh yep hopefully there's no bear tonight and we'll see how the night goes here I could also monitor the the thermometer due to my body heat it could maybe it could maybe have some increased temperature showing in the display let's see how that goes all right sorry about last night oh huh. it was extreme cold here I remember seeing uh, my temperature is gone to minus four and there was lots of snow on the top of this lots of lots of them on top of my tent so I've been taking out all that snow out time to time and didn't have time to record anything basically it was just surviving so I can see my my thermometer shows is 10 no it's 0 celsius yeah it's crazy when it's too cold mine doesn't work at all don't know what to do you will just do your minimum survivals <sighs> so let's see what's the outside look like oh man oh no I don't have energy for that. Maybe I'll cook a meal and then pack up and go. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe you can see it now. Wow. Okay, so I am preparing some rice and put an egg on it. It's burning over there, I guess. Yeah, it's preparing. So, while uh, it's cooking, I'll just pack this one to go outside. You can see. We had more snow, that's obvious, and it's also forecast more coming. So, I'm out of here. Finally, I managed to get that tent in that little circle over there. Honestly, it took me like 20 minutes, no, 30 minutes to figure out everything. Yeah, it was harder. It was actually harder than camping. I would say that. I, I'm just thinking why should we just go with all this mess? We should have some good way of doing it. Maybe they have some other good camping tents. Easy to set up and everything. But I don't think this is a good way of doing it. So you can see the camper I was in. Yeah, it's two seconds to open. Two seconds to open, one hour to close. And it's a hassle. I hate that. 
wearing my boots, snow boots and everything, it's definitely a hassle. It could, uh, yeah, thinking about this camp uh, tent, can, it can accommodate three people and these are the, the, the specification of that one. Didn't really like it, so I'm good to go, ready to roll up. Here we are. Okay. Here I am now. Oh my god, big out. Here we are. Day's over for me. Heading out. I need to be careful. So I had my shoes because my shoes weren't uh, long enough to protect me from water. So water is going into my rubber boots. So I had some garbage bag wrapped around. <laughs> but I can still feel water in my shoes. Here we go. Here we go. Oh yeah, water went in to go take a shower. Alright, adventure is over. I should be heading out soon. Heading home soon. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, man. Stuff over there. Thank you.